Hey there, Fox out here, and we are taking a look at Nocturnal Vision. Let's dive straight into it, shall we? Am I ready to leave? Now, uh, let's see. Oh, nice part. When the crosshair turns red, you can drag quote by pressing E. Thank you. Yeah, my laptop. Nice. Some books there. Dirty sock. Random clothes. Sleep. I have to clean my room. What is the pig sign here? So, yes. Uh, some more boxes. Seems like an average day. I should check my laptop before I go. E. Oh, okay, I have to press screen. Uh, Viral Horror Urban Exploration. <laughs> it's dead I am. Uh, spookiest haunted house. This is no normal house. Its backstory even helps to add to the spookiness. Built in the 60s, this house was home for several serial killers. Now and then, all is left is the remains of the lives that were taken in this place. Why is it still a mystery? Numerous reports of disappearances have been made after some people have visited this house. Do not recommend to explore this house by any means. It's not safe, and you might not return from it. Well, perfect for me. So can I leave now? Yes, I can. I guess so much for cleaning. Let's go. Oh, there's the house. Gonna hop back in. Mm. The good. <laughs> uh, I fucking love that. Uh, uh, I'm genuinely surprised that they let me do that. All right. You know what? That's the best thing I could ask for. Okay, let's do that again. Yep, check my laptop. Okay. Yada yada. Straight out. Let's go. Of course, you have to turn your flashlight. Eee. Fancy. So the first time I have control over the flashlight. Oh, it's an actual flashlight with a beam that isn't two inches in front of my face. Yeah, no, definitely no serial killers in here. Hey, open up. That's locked. I'll look for another way. Ooh, back door. Alright. No. Uh. Trash. Oh, look. The shovel. The crime weapon in progress. I definitely will not be buried in the backyard here. Ooh, bike. Infinite darkness, alright. What isn't this peach here? Oh. This is the basement. Yeah, you think? No bathroom. Open. Nothing. Alright, this is Urban X Exploration. Right, I I'm surprised that still works. What's over here? Newspaper, dirty food. It doesn't seem edible. Well, why would you eat it? Well, I see we have neighbors. Uh, canned food, a bunch of random stuff. Pizza. Some leftovers. We love the ambiance here. Food. Dead body. More dead bodies. Uh... Dishes. Right, let's head upstairs now. This lower is the garage. 
rude. Open. At least the attic. Oh, the attic. No, fuck you. Nothing much in around here. Phone. The line is dead. That is a shame. No, I'm just clunked like that. Alright. Yeah, fine. I got that line. Teddy bear. That definitely didn't fall. And a garage key. Huzzah. TV. Not modder. <laughs> I'm stupid. That displays static. How the fuck is it displaying static? Is it even connected? It's not connected to anything. What type of witchcraft is this? Yeah, a lot of beers too. Of course there is. And supposed to killers without beer. Oh, the markings of a family. What the fuck is that? Who's in here now? No Feratsu? It's a key. Hmm. Neat. Something pleasant is in the basement. Now my urban ex exploration instincts tell me to go investigate. The door is locked. Amazing. Never mind. I can't do shit. All right, straight into the basement we go. Hello. Nice pony. I like it. I see there's a phone here with a flashlight. Update 1, 1 o'clock at 4.30 a.m. The house just seems abandoned overall. Nothing has happened. Update 2, 1.51. About 10 minutes in, I'm starting to feel a bit overwhelmed. I really don't like the environment in this place. I've heard several weird noises, feel like I'm being watched. Update 3. 2.02 a.m. Getting in this place was a complete mistake. Somebody's definitely stalking me, but I can't see it. Update 4. 2.05. The door's locked. I got no way of like, getting out. I'm screwed. Update 5. Something is coming to the basement. The phone is upstairs. Alright, that is fantastic. Yeah, for serial killer, uh, basement, this is pretty clean. Hello? Let's keep it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Something's around. Let's keep it. Let's keep it. How the fuck you going, sir? PT noises. <laughs> I love it. Did the back door just open? Well, I'm surprised you could tell it was just the back door opening. Freedom. <laughs> And that was the end of Nocturne Abyss. If you like this awesome today, please be sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more. Hit that notification button because we also do music here as well. And I will be seeing you guys later. Bye.